Hello, welcome to Shad Life. Exciting news. This bike is all ready to go and I'm going to put it up for sale. I am going to sell it on Facebook Marketplace. It's pretty much where I sell all my bikes and it'll only be sold locally here. So for those of you that aren't local, I'm sorry. It's just too difficult to try to sell it and pack it up and ship it and all of that. So I'm going to sell it locally. Facebook Marketplace isn't quite up there yet. So this is your warning to start looking if you're local. Um, size small, Polygon Cisco T8. It's been ridden about four times. <laughs> um, I think when I looked at Strava, because I was keeping track of it on Strava, it was under 70 miles of riding. Um, and there you have it. Uh, I'm going to start it at $1,500. Um, I'm doing that price because I paid $19.99 for it plus shipping. So it was a little, and tax. So it was a little over, it was almost like closer to $2,200. Um, it's retail is $24. Um, and it's, it's, slightly used <laughs> but it's in like new condition They're, like nothing's worn out on it or anything and the tires are still crisp <laughs> right so if you want an almost brand new bike at a really good deal check facebook marketplace um so there you have it that's going up for sale so now that i announced that this is going up for sale remember it's a size small so i'm five foot seven so if you're kind of curious as to who it would be good for. There you go. Um, next bike, I already ordered it, is going to be a hardtail. Um, a bunch of you gave me suggestions. The reason I'm doing a hardtail is my salsa is literally going in in a couple of days and it should be ready to ride here soon. Um, and so I thought, well, why not test another hardtail? Um, somebody mentioned uh, Santa Cruz Chameleon, and it's like, yeah, I'd really like to try that one, but it's a, just outside of the budget price point. I'm not quite there yet. My YouTube channel isn't big enough. I can't be dumping that kind of money into reviews. Maybe someday I will be able to. That's up to you. Subscribe if you want me to that. But um, I decided to get a bike very similar, but in a budget price. And somebody mentioned it, and I looked at it, and I was kind of like, because there's a couple of things I don't like about it right off the bat, just looking at it. But I thought, why not? I'll do it. So I did it. I ordered a Poseidon Norton. Um, it was $9.99. I also ordered a size medium, which is usually not what I get. I almost always get small. But I was really looking at the geometry numbers and crunching them and seeing that a medium would probably be a better fit for me. And then... Another interesting thing about that bike is it has a longer stem than you would find on like a progressive hardtail. <laughs> so it's a 60 millimeter stem. So I was like, okay, so it's got a reach of 440 or 445, something like that. So my plan is, and it'll probably be almost immediate. I don't even know if I'll ride the bike with the 60 millimeter stem. So I might swap to a 35 millimeter stem and that's why I went with the medium. So that would be like the only part I'd probably swap out right away. I might ride it once in its pure stock form, but <laughs> I'll, 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 if I take it up to Cayuna, I'll bring an extra stem to make sure I can just swap it out right away. Um, so there you have it. It'll be the Poseidon Norton. Here's a picture of it. Looks pretty cool. Um, and there'll be a couple of things I know right off the bat that I'll talk about when I get the bike should be here in about a week or so. So there you have it. There's my announcement that this is going up for sale. Uh, Facebook Marketplace, local only. Sweet. If you like this kind of content, please subscribe <laughs> and hit the like button. That's how I can do this more and more if I know that's what you want out there. Sweet. Appreciate your support for my channel. Peace.